Sa sugbo At unay syudad nga Welcome ka mo Kung gustong mag-relax At mag-unwind There's a lot here that you can find Pwede mong i-enjoy Ang among beaches Pahiyong sa katawahan And beautiful places Dilawi ang among garbong Inasal sa kalambi Imog yung balikan Unsapay gipa Dali na sa dambayan ko Dalit 
na diri inday Sugat na mausuag Katawan na mapinanggaon Limpyo ang hapsay Malinawan kang yunay Kaminti ang mga kabalata Mag-uban, mag-enjoy kita Sa habag katambahin sa sugbo At tunay syudad nga welcome ka mo Kung gustong mag-relax at mag-anuay There's a lot here that you can find Pwede mong i-enjoy ang among beaches Pahiyong sa katawahan and beautiful places Dinawi ang among gawin Sapay gipaabot mo Dali na sa dagbayan ko Enjoy kita Cause somewhere in the south There's a place for you and me Our city Sa subo At tunay syudad nga Welcome ka mo Kung gustong mag-relax At mag-anuay There's a lot here that you can find Pwede mong i-enjoy Ang among beaches Pahiyong sa katawahan And beautiful places Tinawi ang among garbong inasal Sa kalami Imog yung balikan Unsapay gipa Dali na sa dagbayan ko Oh, 
ay mag-enjoy kita Cause somewhere in the south There's a place for you and me Sa habag at ang bahin sa sugbo At unay syudad nga welcome ka mo Kung gustong mag-relax at mag-anoy There's a lot here that you can find Pwede mong i-enjoy ang among beaches Pahiyong sa katawahan and beautiful places Dilawi ang among gawin Sa paigi pa abut mo, dali na sa dagbayan ko. Enjoy kita Cause somewhere in the south There's a place for you and me Our city Mag-enjoy kita Cause somewhere in the south There's a place for you and me Our city Sa habag at ang bahin sa sugbo At unay syudad nga welcome ka mo Kung gustong mag-relax at mag-ano Pwede mong i-enjoy ang among beaches Pahiyong sa katawahan and beautiful places Dilawi ang among garbong inasal Sa kalambi, imog yung balikan Kung sa paigi paabot mo Dali na sa dagbayan ko Enjoy kita Cause somewhere in the south There's a place for you and me Our city Mag-enjoy kita Cause somewhere in the south There's a place for you and me Our city Sa habag at ang 
sambahin sa subo At tunay syudad na welcome ka mo Kung gustong mag-relax at mag-anuay There's a lot here that you can find Pwede mong i-enjoy ang among beaches Pahiyong sa katawahan and beautiful places Tinawi ang among garbong inasal Sa kalambi, imog yung balikan Kung sa paigi paabot mo Dali na sa dakbayan ko Ang 
Mag-uban, mag-enjoy kita Cause somewhere in the south There's a place for you and me The Our city Sa habag katangbahin sa subo At tunay syudad na welcome ka mo Kung gustong mag-relax at mag-unwind There's a lot here that you can find Pwede mong i-enjoy ang among beaches Pahiyong sa katawahan and beautiful places Tinawi ang among garbong inasal Sa kalampi ay mong iyong balikan Kung sa paigi paabot mo Dali na sa dakbayan ko
sa sugbo At tunay syugdad nga welcome ka mo Kung gustong mag-relax at mag-anuay There's a lot here that you can find Pwede mong i-enjoy ang among beaches Pahiyong sa katawahan and beautiful places Tinawi ang among garbong in Sapay gi pa abut mo, dali na sa dagbayan ko. Please stand for the Thanksgiving song to be performed by Elizabeth Bolo.
Please remain standing for the Philippine National Anthem and City of Talisay Hymn. You may now take your seats. To formally receive us all tonight, please welcome Talisay City Councilor Lester Daan and Committee Chair for Tourism and Culture. Mayang gabi, kanatong tanan. Kumusta naman mo? Andam na ba mo sa atong Miss City of Talisay 2022 karong gabi o na? Hinay man. Andam na ba mo sa atong Miss City of Talisay 2022? Okay, nakusok-kusok na. Pitaw, una sa tanan, akong pagtahod o pagyukbo sa atong aksyon agad, Mayor Sam Sam Gulias. Atong tagag masipang pakpak, palihog. Sa atong maanyag na Congresswoman sa atong primero distrito, Ma'am Ria Gulias, masipang pakpak, palihog. 
o sa atong Vice Mayor Choi Asnar, o ganiya usab kanato ang atong mga konsihales. Attorney, konsihal, Attorney Rocky Bas. O si konsihal, Danny Caballero. Sa atong mga Board of Judges, sa atong mga barangay officials, sa atong mga 22 ka barangay kapitanes, sa atong department heads, o kanatong mga pinalanggang talisaynon, may gabi eh. Mingaw man, usbo na ko, may gabi eh. Alright. Isip Committee Chairman sa Tourism and Culture and Arts, Welcome sa atong Miss City of Talisay 2022 Grand Coronation Night. Kini agig halad pasalamat sa atong mahal nga patron, Santa Teresa de Avila. Kanatong tanan, Advance Happy Festa, Viva Santa Teresa, ug daghang daghang salamat. Thank you very much, City Councilor Lester Don.
Live at the City of Delisai Sports Complex, the search for Miss City of Delisai 2022, the modern day Talisainon. Pantaliano of Barangay Poblacion wearing a Malaika Yamas creation. of the Lisai 2022, our performers, the Lisai City Performing Arts, KDF Kansuku Dance Fusion, and Knapsack Dancers, choreographed by Ronico Kiro. Miss City of the Lisai 2019, Angelica Pantaliano of Barangay Poblacion, wearing a Malaika Yamas creation. It's time to meet our 22 candidates representing the 22 barangays of the city of Talisay in their fun wear by Malaika Yamas, shoes by Shandar. Starting with candidate number one, Maquillage by Ryan May Curtis. Shalaysa Fire Jordan Gia, Barangay Lawa Anuno! 
Candidates number two, Jenny Mekiach by Jenny Boy Urbano. Maayong gabi, Talisay! Daphne Jane Rakuma, Barangay Kabuhatro. Candidate number three, Mekiach by Jovert Redalosa. This is Niraya Olive Hernando Bonhot from Barangay P O B L A C I O N, your very own Barangay Poblacion. Candidate number four, Maquillage by Kendra Reyes. Marie May Maglukot. Bayangay Lina! Candidate number five, Mekiach by John D. Kutanda. Good evening, everyone. I am Christine Joy Cañeda, Bayangay Kansoho. Candidate number six, Mekiach by Raj Hatiko. Adela Jane Kataka. Representing Barangay Manipis! Candidate number seven, Maquillage by Lovi Ibanez. Vanessa Sahol, representing Barangay Tapu. Candidate number eight, Maquillage by Lemuel Viking. Barangay Tabunok. Candidate number nine, Mekiaj by Raj Hatiko. Maayong gabi, Talisay. I am Hannah Lorraine Gabutin, representing Barangay Gandulawan. Candidate number ten, Mekiaj by Ryan May Curtis. Candidate number 11, Maquillage by Josel Espina. Maayong gabi, Tali Sainons. I am Melody Jane Infante, representing Barangay Dumlo. Candidate number 12, Maquillage by Louis Ibanez. I am Laikisha Yamido Briones, all the way from the Barangay Mountain of Talisay, Haklupa! Candidate number 13, Maquillage by Harvey Christian Baligua. Raika Barquez, representing Barangay Pua! Candidate number 14, Maquillage by Jovert Redalosa. Gizau Bantulan, Barangay Mohan! Candidates number 15, Maquillage by Jenny Boy Urbano. Catherine Flores from Barangay Lawan Tres. Candidates number 16, Maquillage by Harvey Christian Baligua. Ari Rose Rojas Ong, representing Barangay San Roque. Candidates number 17, Maquillage by Chris Baggio. Gliza Fabre Bulgado, Barangay Maghawai. Candidates number 18, Maquillage by Lemuel Viking. Katrina May Tabige, loud and proud to represent Barangay Bulaka. Candidates number 19, Maquillage by Josel Espina. Christine Joy Daklan, Barangay Biaso. Candidates number 20, Maquillage by John D. Kutada. Alexis May Wingfield, Barangay Tanque. Candidates number 21, Maquillage by Little Buck. Maayong gabi, ladies and gentlemen. I am Angela Christiana McKinney, 
proud and honored to represent Barangay Latin. Candidates number 22, Makiosh by Kendra Reyes. Maayong gabi, Talisay. My name is Jesslyn Marie Filashano, representing Lawaan Dos. Ladies and gentlemen, let's give our candidates in their funwear by Malaika Yamas, shoes by Shandar, a big round of applause. Please welcome our hosts tonight, Vince Escario and Carla Henry. Yes, yes, ladies and gentlemen, advance happy fiesta talisay. Mayung gabi kanatong tanan. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Good evening, talisay. Good evening, Miss Carla Henry. Good evening, Vince. As you can tell, I prepared very well for tonight. Outfit kung outfit you this evening because tonight is going to be a very memorable night because we are going to crown another new Bidibining Talisay or Miss City of Talisay. And of course, tonight we have 22 lovely, intelligent, and equally talented ladies representing 22 barangays of the city of Talisay. And I believe, and this is just a little birdie told me, that this is the first time that all 22 barangays were able to give a representative for the competition this evening. That's correct. So Miss Talisay will have a whole year reign as an ambassador of goodwill to both local and international events. Now our production theme for this year, ladies and gentlemen, is the modern Talisaynon, who, as we all know, is resilient, dependable, productive, and above all, God-fearing. You know, I think the ladies are all qualified. We got a glimpse of that during the pre-judging, didn't we? What is very, very impressive about this pageant is that not only do we have very distinguished members of the Board of Judges, but they also have a very, very tedious screening process. They do. And I don't know, I, I'm a little biased, but fantastic hosts as well, right? That's correct. <laughs> I couldn't agree more, Carla. <laughs> but you know, as we are also celebrating the lovely ladies this evening, we are also, or Talisa is about to celebrate their annual fiesta. And I have to say, this is really one of the most delicious fiestas in the entire province of Cebu because the search of the Miss City of Talisay is one of the highlights of the Halad Inasal Festival and the City Fiesta in honor of their patroness Santa Teresa de Avila. And tomorrow, October 14, at the Talisay Central School Ground, Talisaynons will experience again the famous Halad Inasal Festival and on October 15 is the grand concert entitled Nochella. Featuring, of course, the fantastic December Avenue. And all of these, ladies and gentlemen, would not have been possible and would not have been successful without the leadership of our young, dynamic, hardworking, Akshon Agad, Mayor of the City of Talisay, Mayor Sam Sam Gulias. Ably assisted, of course, by the equally handsome and young Vice Mayor Richard Francis, Choi Aznar, and the entire council. And of course, the support of the beautiful, hardworking district representative of the first district of the province of Cebu, Congresswoman Rhea May Gulias. Let's give them all, ladies and gentlemen, a warm round of applause, please. Yes, you know, Vince, they always said, behind a great man is a great woman. But in this scenario, she's not behind, she's right beside. Beautifully Equal. said. And now it's time to give her the platform to give her inspirational message this evening. Ladies and gentlemen, please give a warm welcome to the very, very hardworking Congresswoman of the 1st District of the Province of Cebu, Congresswoman Rhea May Gulias. Maayong gabi ka natong tanan! Una sa tanan, ako ang pagtahod sa ato ang action agad, Mayor, Mayor Sam Sam Gulias.
O siyempre, kung naatay action agad mayor, naasatay action agad vice mayor, vice mayor Choi Asnar. Sa ato ang city councilors, barangay councilors, 22 ka barangay captains, and to our board of judges, department heads, barangay officials, city officials, Kanatong tanan, may gabi eh. Dako lang kaayon akong kalipay to see everyone gathered here tonight. Kay for two years, wag yung taaning mga inaning nga kalingawan, kalihukan. But now, we are here, getting back on track, and slowly getting our lives back. I just want to thank everyone who contributed and, to, um, and who supported in our city's initiative in making Talisay City um, COVID-free. Ako alang ning special mention kay sa panahon sa kalisod, grabe yun kaayo ni silag um, sakripisyo o kahago para maabot sa ato ang naabtan karon Sa ato ang City officials, councillors, mga barangay captain, and of course, ato ang action agad mayor. If it wasn't because of them, we wouldn't be here in this pageant tonight. So ato at silang hatagan o masipang pakpak paliho. <laughs> to our candidates, I just have to say, you all look so stunning and beautiful tonight. To whoever will take home the crown tonight, rest assured that as your congresswoman of the first district of Cebu, naaragyud ko diri, ready, and always um, with you. Kanunay mo suporta sa imuhang mga plano, labi na, pa, labi na kung para na sa kaayuhan sa atuang pinalanggang talisay. And please know that I am always here ready mo suporta sa imuhang mga advocacies. O di na lang kaayo ni Nako Tason because I know that everyone here is just as excited as I am. Thank you so much for having me here in this momentous event. Kanatong tanan, salamat, o may gabi, o advance, happy fiesta. Daghang salamat. Thank you very much, Congresswoman Rhea May Gulias. Ladies and gentlemen, to introduce the distinguished members of the Board of Judges, please welcome TV personality OJ Sima Franca. Thank you very much, Vince. Maayong gabi Talisay! Ladies and gentlemen, good evening. Now, earlier this evening, the pre judging took place at the conference hall of Talisay City College. All of our 22 candidates did very well, and all of their scores are now inputted into the scoring system. And in the pre-judging panel are the very same people who, are, who we are very proud and privileged to have with us tonight. Very distinguished and accomplished personalities in their own right, we have 11 people who have graciously accepted the difficult task of choosing Miss City of Talisay 2022. So ladies and gentlemen, our board of judges, starting with judge number one. She is an advocate for women empowerment and education for children in Miss Tourism City of Talisay 2016. She is the owner and founder of Charles Edwin Bridal, Charles Edward Bridles and Events and the Chief Operating Officer of Staff Virtual. Please welcome Miss Fiona Lideza. Our second judge is the president and CEO of Camp Hotel Technologies Trading and Services. He has served in IT and construction industry as IT director and in varying capacities for over 10 years and brings more than six years of executive experience from Silicon Valley, California. One of the successful entrepreneurs of Talisay with a heart to give back to the Talisayans. Please welcome judge number two, Archie Reyes Campo. Our third judge is Miss Bogo 2000, second runner up. A business owner, 
She's the owner of Darnicon Enterprises, Talisai City, Cebu, Telepreneur Corporation, City Stockless, Talisai City, Cebu Lor Loran International Corporation, Strategic Business District Owner, Talisai City, Cebu, a member of the Public Speaking Institute, Speech Camp, hashtag Speak the Difference, a self-love advocate, a student of life, and she believes that beauty is power. Please welcome judge number three, Connie Codinera. Our fourth judge is a commercial and runway model and is Mr. Island Tourism 2022 grand winner. Please welcome Rafael Tan. Our next judge is the first ever Miss International Queen Philippines and Miss International Queen 2022, Fuchsia and Ravenna. Our next judge is a star magic artist, a social media influencer, a member of Glamour Models of Region 8. A print and ramp ad model, Mr. National Universe Philippines 2022 and 2023, Pinoy Big Brother Adult Edition Top 5, and Southeast Asian Games 2019 Gold Medalist. Please welcome Michael Ver Anton Kamali. Our seventh judge is Mutiana Pilipinas Asia Pacific International 2014. Bidibining Pilipinas Grand International 2018. National Director of Iasna Pilipinas and Juris Dr. A. Please welcome our judge number seven, Ava Patalinho. Our eighth judge is Philippines Top Fashion Designer. LGBTQ advocate and the co-founder and co-chairman of Queen Philippines. Please welcome Wendell Casido. <laughs> Judge number nine is Miss Cebu 2009. Bini Bini Bilibinas Intercontinental 2014 and second runner-up of Miss Intercontinental 2014. Please welcome Chris Tiffany Hansen. Judge number 10 is a three-time PBA champion, ASEAN Basketball League champion, 13-time PBA All-Star back-to-back, and the number one counselor of the city of Cebu, the Cebuano Hotshot City Counselor of Cebu, Honorable Donaldo Dondon Hontiveros. And our final judge for tonight and the chairman of the board is a world-class fashion designer. He was the recipient of many awards and accolades, including the Most Creative Force Award by Tatler Philippines in 2018 and, in, and the 2011 Best Designer in China Fashion Awards, to name a few. He has designed some of the dresses of our beauty queens including the national costume of Miss Universe Philippines Gazzini Ganados that eventually bagged the Best in National Costume Award during the pageant's final night. He is the go-to designer of many famous celebrities and women in power, including our Vice President, Sara Duterte, Cebu Governor, Governor Gwendolyn Garcia, and of course, Cebu First District Representative, Congresswoman Rhea Gullias. Ladies and gentlemen, let's put our hands together and, of course, our hearts together for the Philippines, Master Couturier, the pride of Talisai, the incomparable Gary Santiago. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, let's give the members of the Board of Judges a big round of applause. <laughs> to officially tally the scores tonight is the very active Mora Sanchez Minoza and Associates accounting firm headed by their managing partner, attorney Rainier Mora. Once again, a round of applause to our distinguished panel of judges and our official tabulators. 
Thank you very much, OJ Sima Franca. Swimsuit Competition. Please welcome back our candidates of Miss City of Talisay 2022 wearing the swimwear by La Sao by Alejandro Godinez Jr. Candidate number one. Chalet Sapphire Joylin Gia. From Barangay Lawaan Uno. Candidate number two, Daphne Jane Racoma. From Barangay Campo Cuatro. Candidate number three, Naraya Olive H. Bonhoff from Barangay Poblacion. Candidate number four, Marie May Maglupot from Barangay Linao. Candidate number five, Christine Joy Canieda. From Barangay Cansojo. <laughs> Candidate number six. 
Candidate number six, Adila Jane Kotoko from Barangay Manipis. Candidates number seven, Vanessa Saho from Barangay Tapul. Candidates number eight, Adrian Lori Batillier from Barangay Tabuno. Candidate number nine, Hannah Lorraine V. Gabutin from Barangay Candulawan. Candidate number ten, Shane Graysell Sansan. From Barangay San Isidro. Candidate number 11, Melody Jane Infante from Barangay Dumlo. Candidate number 12, Laikisha Liamedo Briones from Barangay Haglupan. Candidates number 13, Raika Abarquez from Barangay Poo. Candidates number 14, Giselle C. Bentulan from Barangay Mohon. Candidate number 15, Catherine P. Flores from Barangay Lawaan Tres. Candidate number 16, Eri Rose Ong from Barangay San Roque. Candidate number 17, Glyza Bulgado from Barangay Maghawai.
Candidate number 18, Katrina May Tabige from Barangay Bulacao. Candidate number 19, Christine Joy Daclan from Barangay Biasong. Candidate number 20, Alexis May Wingfield from Barangay Tanque. Candidate number 21, Angela Christiana McKinney from Barangay Lagtang. Candidate number 22, Jessalyn Marie Palesciano from Barangay Lawaan. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome back Vince Escario. Thank you very much, the voice of Cebu, June Rabin. Ladies and gentlemen, our candidates have spent much time together in the last three weeks. Wonderful memories have been shared and lasting friendships have been forged. And one lady, and only one lady, stands out for touching the lives of her fellow candidates with a special brand of friendship. In gratitude, her fellow candidates have chosen her as this year's Miss Photogenic. Or Miss Friendship. Miss Friendship will receive a trophy, sash, bouquet, and a cash prize. And to present the award to Miss Friendship is the Honorable Counselor Lester Daan. Ladies and gentlemen, Miss Friendship as chosen by her fellow candidates. Candidate number 22, Jessalyn Marie Feliciano. For our bouquet of flowers, we would like to thank June Villanelle, Flowers and Events. Thank you very much. Next, we have Miss Photogenic. Miss Photogenic was chosen by our official photographer, Mr. Mark Dallas. The winner will receive a trophy, sash, bouquet, and a framed photo of herself and a cash prize. To reveal and present the award, please welcome Mr. June DeLiman. Mr. June DeLiman will now reveal the winner of Miss Photogenic. And Miss Photogenic is candidate number 21, Angela Christiana McKinney. Again, thank you very much, June Villanelle, Flowers and Events. We also have special awards this time from our corporate sponsors, ladies and gentlemen. Candidate number 22, 
Again, congratulations to candidate number 21 for winning Miss Photogenic. We move on to our special awards. This time from our corporate sponsors, we have the face of Camp Hotel. The winner will receive a sash, bouquet of flowers, gift packs, and a cash prize of 15,000 pesos plus 15,000 pesos worth of gift packs. To present the award is Mr. Archie Campo. 15,000 pesos and 15,000 pesos worth of gift certificates. They go to candidate number 10, face of Camp Hotel, Shane Graysell Sansan. Congratulations, candidate number 10, Shane Graysell Sansan, for winning the face of Camp Hotel. Again, thank you very much, June Villanelle, Flowers and Events. Another corporate award, Laure Laurent. The winner will receive a cash, sash, bouquet, and gift packs. To present the award is Miss Connie Codinera. Laure Laurent. Candidate number 17, Gliza Bulgado. Congratulations. Two more corporate awards, ladies and gentlemen. The next award is a staff virtual ambassadress. The winner will receive a sash, a bouquet, gift packs, and a cash prize. And to present the award is a beautiful and elegant Miss Fiona Lideza. The staff virtual ambassadress title goes to candidate number 21. Angela Christiana McKinney. Congratulations, candidate number 21, Angela Christiana McKinney, for earning the title of Staff Virtual Ambassadors. And our last corporate award for tonight, ladies and gentlemen, or for this segment, is the face of Charles Edwards. Again, to present the award is Miss Fiona Lideza. This is the face of Charles Edwards. The face of Charles Edwards is candidate number 20, Alexis May Wingfield. Again, for a beautiful bouquet, we would like to thank June Villanelle, Flowers and Events. Congratulations to our first set of special awardees. Let's give them all a warm round of applause. Thank you very much, Vince Escario. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the mayor of the city of Talisay, the Honorable Mayor Gerald Anthony Samsam Gulias for his fiesta message. Mayang gabi eh. Murang magkatugon. Mayang gabi eh ka na tanan. 
Una sa tanan akong pagtahod, of course, sa ito ang Congresswoman, Congresswoman Rhea Gulia sa itong atagag masipag pakpak paliyog. Of course, sa mga city councilors na naadiri ka ron, Konsihal Rocky Bas, Konsihal Lester Daan, o Konsihal Danny Caballero, at itong atagag masipag pakpak paliyog. Sa ito ang mga Board of Judges, believe ko sa production ka ron, at mga Board of Judges, I see some good friends, I see people with good advocacies that can change the world, and I see, of course, people who I just see on TV na naadiri ka ron at itong pakpakan at itong Board of Judges palihog. O ka na itong tanan, akong usbon, may gabi eh. Di lang kayo na ako ni Tason, ang ako rag yung gusto ipaabot ka ninyo, daghan kay taglihukan. We are in our final three days sa tuwang fiesta celebration. Sa last three days na ito, naadiya ang pinakadag ko ng mga festive activities na ito. Karoon ng Mista Lisay, maabot toon niya si Marco Gumabaw, Ugma, ang Halad Festival, o ang uh, October 14 na itong Nochella Festival. Kanira mo yun ang atong gusto gibuat sa gobyerno, duwa na mo katuig na priso in town, na angay sa mamawi ang gobyerno na balik duwa katuig sa ng kalingawa na ihatag diha kaninyong tanan. Usahay God, sa usa ka adlaw upat ka area, usa ka adlaw upat ka area ta maghimo kalingawan. Pero ako ra yung hangyo kaninyo, ang ako lang hangyo kaninyo kung magnatay kalingawan karon. Kung naaman tay kalingawan nagipanglaag-laag diri sa Lisay, gusto lang ko mahibaw mo og ibutang sa tong tagsa-tagsa kakasing-kasing na tanan na tong ipangbuhat karon, halad yun ni ni Santa Teresa ni Avila na wa tabyae sa panahon sa COVID ug sa Odet. Pinakadakong pakpak ni Santa Teresa di Avila. Sa kinalasan, ang gusto na ginako ingon sa umaabot na Mista Lisay. Kubaw ko, lisod kaayo ang gibuhat para maabot ang puntuha. Tulog kasi manang trabaho, screenings, at tog mga events, tagan kay question, prejudging pa. Pero inigdaog ni mo karon the work, the best, the pinakalisod na trabaho diha umaabot. Kay ako isip mayor, gusto yun ko na ipromote ang talisay dili lang sa probinsya sa Subo kundi sa Tibuok, Pilipinas. O dako kaayog tabang, dako kay Grohl, ang tamis talisay kay siya'y ambasadres labi na sa turismo na to sa syudad. So akong ihangyo lang sa umaabot na pistalisay, the hard work is yet to come but the best is yet to come as well. Kaninyong tanan, salamat. Hinaot unta malingaw mo sa tuang fiesta og Mr. Lisay. Salamat kaninyong tanan. Daghang salamat Mayor Samsam Gulias. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Tilo Tingog nga Talisay non 2019 Grand Champion and currently a Viva Artist, Jeremy Trangia.
hinay, hinay, hinay. By ano tabi? By place. Kamusta talisay? Ayun, kataas kig energy dire, dire. Kamusta talisay? Okay ra pod. Okay ra mo? Okay ra mo dia? Dire, oy, grabe ko sa kay la energy dire. Dapat inyo i level. <laughs> So ayun, um, gusto lang ko magpasalamat sa atong Mayor, Mayor Sam Sam Gullias. Thank you so much po for inviting me here. And also to his wife, Congresswoman Rhea Gullias. Thank you so much po. And also sa ating Vice Mayor na si Choi Asnar, as a si Vice Mayor. And also sa mga city councilors, maraming maraming salamat. O kay Sir, Sir Junja, thank you kaayo. So okay lang pa kung mukanta usap ako? Okay lang? So gusto lang kong mangutana. Kinsay na ay mga ex dire. Kinsay na ay mga ex. Nakay ex. Nga naman. Gibuwagan ka or ikay nakigbuwag. Ay ikay nakigbuwag. Kinsay na ay mga ex dire isa kamot. Ayay, kita ko ni ate girl ni isa kamot. Okay lang na maka move on ra ka. So kani nga kanta. Para ni sa si inyo mga ex, i-shout out inyo mga ex. I-shout out ka ng ex ninyo! Kana! Music please! This is a shout out to my ex. Heard he left some other chick. Yeah, that hurt me on the dream. Forget that boy, I'm moving in. I hope she getting better kids. Hope she ain't picking it like I did, baby. Too far long as to call it quits. Forget that boy, I'm moving in. Guess I should say thank you for the head shoes and your tattoos. Oh, baby, I'm cool. By the way, it's your room of two. Anyway, go ahead, babe, I'ma live my life. My life, yeah. Deleted all your pics They're back your number from my phone mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, you took all your good gear But you ain't getting this up no more Cause now I'm living so legit So legit, even though you broke my heart in two, baby But I said right back, I'm so brand new, baby Boy, read my lips, I'm over you, uh, over you Gusto ka makanta dire? Ali! Ayaw mo? Makanta ko na ako si Kuya. My life, my life, yeah. Ayaw kay Bob? Ay, dito siya upang kanta! Iyo pa lang siya na, You ain't my heartbreak and then baby who I am.
Gato ko manamo manako. Wapa ko na human. Napay last isa. Okay lang. Kay nagprepare pa man ang ato mga bini-bini sa likod para sa evening gown. So ato sa sila ipatek sa ilang time. Kutasa di mo sayaw eh. Taysa. Kung kikutasan ko. Hi Michael Ver. <laughs> Dili friend, barkada mi anang Michael Ver. <laughs> So ayun, um, kani nga kanta kabalo jud ko nga kabalo mo anay na song. Kinsa ka ila ni Arthur Nery dire? Oh, daghan jud kayo. Kay ako ako nang crush si Arthur Nery. So, kani nga kanta if you know the song you can sing along with me. Music please. Di ko na na Jeremy Trang here. Reset na mawai. Let's take our time tonight, girl. Above us, all the stars are watching. There's no place I'd rather be in this world.
Please welcome back our candidates wearing evening gowns by Roy Irwin Tizon, inspired by the seven jewels of the world, emerald, ruby, sapphire, topaz, amethyst, citron, and diamond. Candidate number one, Chalet Sapphire Joylin Gia of Barangay Lawaan Uno. Barangay Captain, the Honorable Joel L. Cabo. Candidate number two, Daphne Jane Racoma from Barangay Campo Cuatro, Barangay Captain, Honorable Rowena B. Edar. Candidate number three, Naraya Olive H. Bonhoff of Barangay Poblacion, Barangay Captain, Honorable Edward S. Alesna. Candidate number four, Marie May Maglukot of Barangay Linao, Barangay Captain, Honorable Ulysses L. Raganas. Candidate number five, Christine Joy Canieda of Barangay Cansoho, Barangay Captain Honorable Vicente L. Oberes. Candidate number six, Adila Jane Cotoco of Barangay Manipis, Barangay Captain Honorable Joselito S. Lorente.
Candidates number seven, Vanessa Sahol of Barangay Tapul. Barangay Captain, Honorable Mary Ann C. Nolasco. Candidates number eight, Adrian Lori Batelier of Barangay Tabuno. Barangay Captain, Honorable Benji A. Cabigas. Candidates number nine, Hannah Lorraine V. Gabute of Barangay Candulawan, Barangay Captain, Honorable Josefina C. Conchal. Candidates number 10, Shane Graysel San San of Barangay San Isidro, Barangay Captain Honorable Adelaida S. Restauro. Candidates number 11, Melody Jane Infante of Barangay Dumlo, Barangay Captain Honorable Nelson A. Abeliana. Candidates number 12, Lakeisha Liamedo Briones of Barangay Hakluban, Barangay Captain Honorable Marisa N. Orbiso. Candidate number 13, Raika Abarquez of Barangay Poo, Barangay Captain Honorable Osmundo 
Jay Manreal Jr. Candidates number 14, Giselle C. Bentulan of Barangay Mohon, Barangay Captain, Honorable Vicente M. Bas. Candidates number 15, Catherine P. Flores of Balangay Lawaan Tres. Barangay Captain, Honorable Frederick L. Marababo. Candidates number 16, Eri Rose Ong of Barangay San Roque. Barangay Captain, Honorable Antonio L. Cabrera Jr. Candidates number 17, Glyza Bulgado of Barangay Maghawai. Barangay Captain Honorable Victor S. Cabatas. Candidates number 18, Katrina May Tabige of Barangay Bulacao, Barangay Captain Honorable Banjo A. Abastilias. Candidate number 19 from Barangay Biason. Barangay Captain Honorable Reynaldo C. Bas. Candidate number 19 is Christine Joy Datlan. Candidate number 20, Alexis May Wingfield of Barangay Tanque. Barangay Captain, Honorable Nelson C. Cabano.
candidate number 21, Angelique Christiana McKinney of Barangay Lagta. Barangay Captain, Honorable Chester T. Salcedo. Candidate number 22, Jessalyn Marie Feliciano of Barangay Lawa Andos. Barangay Captain, Honorable Jose Edwin R. Ectobanes. Ladies and gentlemen, Miss City of the Lisi 2022 candidates in their evening gowns by Roy Irwin Tizon, inspired by the seven jewels of the world, emerald, ruby, sapphire, topaz, amethyst, citron, and diamond. Our male escorts, Prince Ronald Tamares, John Gahudo, Ezekiel Alusin and Craig Mack, wearing the creations of Griffins Malazarte of GMO. Special thanks to Knapsack Dancers and KDF and Subo Dance Fusion. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome W. Copa Multi Gold Medalist. John Willis Ubalde. Good evening, Talisay. Born 
March, John Willis Ubalde, World Championship of Performing Arts, multi gold medalist. Please welcome back Arch Simafranca. Ladies and gentlemen, let's give our beautiful candidates in their evening gowns a big round of applause. And at this time, ladies and gentlemen, it is time to give out our second set of special awards. And I'd like to request attorney Rainier Mora of Mora Sanchez and Mioza and Associates to hand in our results. Attorney, thank you very much. And ladies and gentlemen, we begin with our best in funwear. She will receive a trophy, sash, bouquet, and a cash prize. May we request Ms. Wynn and Villanueva, tourism focal person, to present the award. 
And our best in funwear is candidate number. Candidate number 21, Angela Christiana McKinney. Representing Barangay Lagtang. Next, we have our best in swimwear, with the candidates wearing their swimsuits by Alejandro Godinez Jr. She will receive a trophy, a sash, a bouquet, and a cash prize. May we request our tourism officer, Ms. Mickey Aznar, to present the award. And our best in swimwear is candidate number... Candidate number 21, Angela Christiana McKinney. Congratulations once again, candidate number 21. Our next award is our Face of Skin 911. And this is to be presented by Miss Eleanor Velasco, the CEO and owner of Skin 911 Medical Group of Companies. Our winner will receive 10,000 pesos gift certificate and a sash. And our Face of Skin 911 is Candidate number, once again, candidate number 21, Angela Christiana McKinney. Our next award is Miss Bella Glow Skin. She will receive 4,500 pesos worth of products and a sash. And this is to be presented by Miss Vanessa Joy Arsenal, the owner of Bella Glow Skin. And Miss Bella Glow Skin is candidate number... Kinsaman! 21, Angela Christiana McKinney. And hand over next award is Miss Smart. She will receive a sash, bouquet of flowers from June Villanelle events, and an Android phone. This is presented by Miss Marian Avenido and Mr. Norman Cerrojales. And Miss Smart is candidate number. All right, this time we have another winner. Candidate number four, Marie May Maglukot. Congratulations, finally we have the best in evening gown. The winner will receive a sash, bouquet of flowers from Jun, Jun Villanelle Flowers and Events, a trophy, and a cash prize. To present the award for the best in evening gown, we have our budget officer, Mr. Edgar Mabunai. And our best in evening gown is candidate number. Who's your bet? Candidate number 20, Alexis May Wheatfield from Barangay Tanque.
Congratulations to all of our winners for our second set of special awards. Ladies and gentlemen, let's give them a big round of applause. Thank you very much, OJ Sima Franca. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome gold medalist of the World Championship of Performing Arts, Rona Jen Lofranco Cañete. Thank you. 
Alright, tayo gabi, mga taga-talisaynon! Kamusta naman mo? Kulbaan na mong tanan? Nakulbaan bang tanan? Oh, di ba? So, alright, before mo, before mo maghinam-hinam sa inyuhang ka mga kandidata, no? Kung mo daog ba or dili. I'd like to give you this one last song for tonight. Something from the great... Oh, nakalimot ko, great, great... Nakalimot ko sa salida, pero <laughs> this is this is the title never enough. Here we go. I'm starting to hold my breath. Let it stay. Thank you very much, Rona Jen Lofranco Cañete. Please welcome back, Carla Henry. Wow, 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 wow. Nakapahuay na ko. So, ready na ko. Ready na ba kong gown? Mona niyang importante. <laughs> But you know what, ladies and gentlemen, the, it, these candidates have already gone through several rounds of intense competition this evening. But they're going to have to go through another one, but just in a little bit, because this is what I like to call the bittersweet moment in any competition. Because we're trimming down 22 deserving, beautiful ladies to only 10. 
These 10 lovely ladies will have to undergo the very intriguing question and answer portion. So, I'm gonna give it back to you, Talisainons. Kinsa magid masood sa top 10. I don't know. Na uwa pa ko kadungog. Kinsa mang yun? Well, I know one person who knows the top 10. So we would like to request attorney Rainier Mora of Mora Sanchez Mendoza and associate accounting firm to hand in the results. Thank you very much, attorney. Here we go, Talisainons, your top 10 for the Miss City of Talisay. Our first finalist this evening is candidate number... Candidate number three, Neraya Olive Bonjok from Barangay Poblacion. Making it into the top 10 is candidate number 14 from Barangay Pohon, Jeziel Bentulan. Joining them is candidate number 11 from Barangay Tublog, Melody Jane Infante. Fourth slot belongs to but candidate number 22 from Barangay Nawa on the check-in. Halfway there and that slot belongs to candidate number 13. Rika Abarquez. Up next, joining them is candidate number 21 from Barangay Lagtang, Angela Christiana McKinney. Take a deep breath because you've made it in. It's candidate number 17 from Barangay Mag Hawaii, Liza Bocado. Only three slots remain and one of them belongs to candidate number 20 from Barangay Tanque, Alexis May Winkfield. Our second to last slot belongs to candidate number 16 from San Roque, Erica Rose Ong. And rounding off the top 10 is candidate number number 10 from Barangay San Isidro, Shane Graciel Sansan. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the top 10 ladies of Miss City of Talisay 2022. To the rest of the ladies, thank you all so much and you will always be part of the Miss City of Talisay family. All right, we now come to the most exciting part of the pageant, the Q&A segment. To assist us with this segment, please welcome Craig Maok and Prince Tamares. So, to let everyone know, here's what's going on. We do have a fishbowl here this evening. Like musical chairs, we in the music, in our fishbowl right there contain the questions. The candidate will take one of these questions, which she will be given 30 seconds to answer the question. When the time is up, she will hear this bell. Nakuyon ko murag exam. Pass your papers. Right, right man is wrong, huh? All right. So, candidate number three, are you ready? Yes, I am. Good evening, by the way. Good evening. So please choose a... So what we have actually here in the questions or th this evening is not necessarily a question, but it is a current issue in the Philippines. And we will say this current issue and our candidate will be given 30 seconds 
to answer how you will solve this issue. So, your issue is Soji Equality Bill. In looking up things, we ought to dependably look at the gander of preferences and hindrances, the advantages and disadvantages. I believe that the government and the rest of the officials has already been in look up to with the rest of that issue. But as for me, as Miss City of Dalisay, I can only do so much. But I hope that I get to contribute to the best of my ability together with you and the rest of the local government unit. Mayong gabi. Thank you very much, candidate number three. Up next is candidate number 14. Hello, candidate number 14. Hello, good evening. So you had your little Miriam Kiambao moment a while ago, but you handled it with so much grace. What can you say about that moment? I was nervous, but I think I slayed. You did. You did slay. Please choose a question, though, or an issue, actually. So your current issue is child labor. Once again, good evening. Based on my personal experience, most reason why there is child labor because of financial crisis a family is facing. And because of that, I think that child labor is unjust. However, I have seen a future in the young people because just like me, I had started my own business at an age of 17. And if the... And if the government unit will support our young people, I think that we can be financially independent. Thank you. Thank you very much, candidate number 14. Up next is candidate number 11. Bitaw, magnegosyo na ka. Hello, candidate number 11. Is yellow your lucky color? I guess it is. It just might be. So you have a question this evening, or your issue is post-pandemic challenges facing our country. Once again, how would you solve post-pandemic challenges facing our country? It is no doubt that the pandemic changed the course of our lives in an instant. And as a beauty queen, I can illuminate ways on how we can rebuild as a society and encouraging all of you to do your part to work with the government as we not only think of a solution, but we become the solution. Thank you. Thank you very much, candidate number 11. Up next is candidate number 22. Hello, candidate number 22. Hello, miss. Good evening. Is this your first pageant? This is my second pageant, miss. Second. Oh, are you going to join some more? I am very much enjoying this. This competition. So you'll join more, no? It's fun. It's also fun. Please choose. It's fun, but it's a lot of hard work, isn't it? Yeah. Gotom na, no? Okay. Your issue for tonight is fake news. Fake news. Good evening, everyone. I'm a human, human student, actually, and fake news is very relevant when it comes to research. And for me, and how I can solve this is to always check the credentials. You always refer if ever that source is trustable and you need to find the basis, especially the date. And you shouldn't believe everything that you find on social media or hearsay because with great power comes with great responsibility and the words will create an impact. Thank you. Thank you very much, candidate number 22. Bitao. Mga trolls. 
please, candidate number 13. Hello, candidate number 13. Hello, Susie. You're quite tall. You're very, very tall. How tall are you? I think I'm 5'6 or 5'7. Five, 5'7? Seven. Five, seven? Wow. So you, which one is taller, your mom or your dad? Is it the genetics? Uh, yeah, it's genetics, but like um, I'm taller than my mom and I'm the same height with my dad. Cons oh. yeah. basket. <laughs> Please choose one. Are you sporty? Do you play sports? No? I'm sorry, Cons. Okay, so your issue for this evening, how would you solve the conflict or a conflict between two nations? How would you solve a conflict between two nations? Good evening, everyone. As a beauty pageant, I will be the walking instrument to solve the conflict of two nations. First is we need to love ourselves so we can love other else. And lastly, be proud of our nation and respect each other's culture, gender, and age. Thank you. Thank you very much, candidate number 13. Up next is candidate number 21. Hello, candidate number 21. Hello. Uh, just, you know, just a question. Nakai igsoon? I'm sorry? Nakai igsoon? What's the English? Do you, oh, sorry, English. Do you have um, a sibling, a sister? Do you have I a sister? I do not. I'm the only child. Are you sure? Positive. Are you sure there's not one in the judges' panel? Secret. <laughs> well, we were all saying that you do look somewhat like one of the judges. <laughs> Madam Carrie, <laughs> Chris, oh Chris, the I, Chris. All right, please choose one. Congratulations, by the way, with all your awards. Thank you so much. Would you like to say thank you to all your fans because I know they've been shouting like crazy. Absolutely, thank you so much, everyone who has been supporting me throughout my first journey as a beauty queen. I love that. That's perfect, okay? All right, but you do have an issue that we would like to know how you would solve it. Okay. And this is unpredictable weather due to climate change or global warming. Once again, unpredictable weather due to climate change or global warming. Due to global warming, weather can be incredibly unpredictable and it can be very tough for those who live in places where it is easy to flood, that's why it is incredibly important for us to know how to prepare in advance for these kinds of things, stock up on food, and pay attention to the weather reports just so you can be prepared for everything. Thank you. Thank you very much. Candidate number 21. Dilit ni pang Miss Intercon. Miss Earth ni siya. Koan Kong. Hello, candidate number 17. You're also very tall, my goodness. You guys, I don't know. Are you, are you into sports? Yeah. Oh. I'm a volleyball player. Volleyball. What got you to, into the sport of volleyball? What? Why do you like volleyball? Because I'm tall and I know I am strong enough to face my, con my, my, my opponents. Oh, I, I would love to see you in one of those games. But for now, can you please choose an issue? All right, a very heavy issue. How would you solve poverty? So I know we are now in high inflation right now. So we need to build more like agriculture and also we should create more products and we should not depend on the goods, uh, imported goods. We should create more products here in the Philippines to save money and of course we could help poor people around the Philippines. Thank you. Thank you so much, candidate number 17. Up next, we have candidate number 20. Hello, candidate number 20. Hello. Very, very pretty, very beautiful. Do you have a special someone? Wala pa. Wala pa? 
Oh, no, single and ready to mingle? Mm, not yet. Not yet, all right. It's okay, take time. Enjoy being single. Please choose a question. Okay, so, your, your issue is inflation rate. How would you solve inflation rate? To solve inflation rate in this country, I believe that we need to export more Filipino products to the outside rather than taking more in because our products are amazing and we as Filipinos, we, have, we can achieve anything. Thank you. Thank you very much. Candidate number 20, up next is candidate number 16. She is absolutely right though, love your own. Love local. You have an entire barangay behind you. Are those your friend, mostly your friends, or is your family out watching you as well? They're, they are also watching, and they are my colleagues. Your colleagues. Where do you work? In New Star Resort and Casino. In New Star. Uh, Asa na areas? As na restaurant? Kaya mga koko reservation. Casino market. Ay, casino. Much better. Mag-amiga <laughs> All right, candidate number 16, please choose an issue. Your issue, and let us know how you would solve this. Mental health. Once again, your issue is mental health. Mayong gabi sa tanan. So mental health is very close to my heart because this is my advocacy. And I believe that to all people who are experiencing mental health issues, we should all take our feelings. Our, our feelings are valid. And we should all think of it as an uncertainty, but let us not dwell to whatever uncertainties that we are feeling because from in time, we will develop this uncertainty towards certainties. Thank you. Thank you very much, candidate number 16. And last but certainly not the least is candidate number 10. Hello, candidate number 10. If you were given a chance, would you have rather gone last, like now, or in the middle, or in the beginning? Any would do. Any would do? So any position would do? Oh. You like the challenge, right? Please choose an issue. Your issue for this evening is, and let us know how you would solve it, is sex trafficking. Once again, your issue and how you would solve it, sex trafficking. For me, I would solve sex trafficking by implementing sex education in the Philippines because this is very important and to protect the women mostly because they are the ones who is being abused. Also by children. I mean, also, the children are being abused. So for me, implementing sexual education is very important because that is lacking in the Philippines. And we should be open-minded by this. That's all. Thank you. Thank you very much, candidate number 10. And gentlemen, thank you very much for your help as well. Well, there you have it, ladies and gentlemen, our top 10 finalists in the very intriguing Q&A portion. And it's in our judges' hands now to decide which of these 10 ladies will proceed to the top five. But before anything else, the, city, the Miss City of Dalisay would not be possible without the following sponsors.
Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Southeast Asian Games Dance Sport Gold Medalist and the pride of Talisay, Pearl Kanyada, together with Wilbert Ounsel. Thank you very much, Pearl Kanyeda and Wilbert Alonso. Please welcome back Vince Escario. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, from the top 10 finalists, everything now boils down to the top five finalists 
on the search for the Miss City of Talisay 2022. Back on stage now, we have our top 10 finalists, and in a few minutes, we will get to know who the five ladies that will make it to the final round of tonight's pageant. May we now request attorney Rainier Mora of Mora Sanchez Menoza and Associates accounting firm to hand in the names of the top five finalists. Thank you very much, attorney. Ladies and gentlemen, Tali Sainons, the top five finalists of the search for Miss City of the Leaside 2022 in no particular order. Good luck to all of you ladies. You've reached this far. And congratulations to you as well. Again, good luck to all of you. The top five finalists of the search for the Miss City of the Leaside 2022. Beginning with candidate number 17, Gliza Bulgado. Followed by candidate number 16, Ari Rose Ong. Third finalist, candidate number 10, Shane Graysell Sansan. Fourth on the list is candidate number 21, Angela Christiana McKinney. And Rounding up the fifth is no other than candidate number 20, Alexis May Wingfield. To the rest of our candidates, thank you very much. We are confident that you will bring this beautiful memory with you for the rest of your lives. There you have them, ladies and gentlemen, the top five finalists on the search for the Miss City of the Lisai 2022. Let's give them all a warm round of applause. Now, these five beautiful, intelligent, and talented ladies will have to hurdle one last challenge, and that is the final question and answer round. The final question was formulated by our tourism officer, Miss Miki Aznar, just hours before the pageant started. May we request Miss City of Talisay pageant chairman, Mr. Ed Mabunay, to hand over the envelope containing the final question. The rest of our candidates will be donning their headsets to make sure that while one candidate will be right here in the middle, the rest of the candidates won't be, won't be able to hear what the final question is. Thank you very much, Mr. Ed Mabunai, one of the best, if not the best budget officers, not only in the province of Cebu, but in the entire country. Remember, ladies and gentlemen, that all our five finalists are on equal footing. Scores are back to zero, so this is the real deal maker for tonight. The final question and answer. May we now have candidate number 17. Candidate number 17 is Gliza Bulgado. She represents Barangay Maghawai. Congratulations, candidate number 17. Now, I shall read the question twice to give you enough time to let it percolate in your mind. And then at your own time and at your own pace, you can give us the answer. Candidate number 17, Gliza. If you will win Miss City of Talisay 2022 and become an ambassador of tourism and goodwill, how or what can you contribute to the Acción Agad administration of Mayor Samsam Gulias? One more time, if you win Miss City of Talisay 2022 and become an ambassador of tourism and goodwill, how or what can you do to contribute to the Action Agad administration of Mayor Samsam Gulias? As a tourism student, I can help because I am a good ambassador 
and I'm, I'm, I'm going to become a good leader in the future. As a tourism, I can help by promoting like Department of Tourism, working with the LGUs, and of course, um, using social medias to promote some sub Goliaths, the Action Agad team, that we could help people when they are in need in disasters and catastrophe. Thank you. Thank you very much. Candidate number 17, Liza Bulgado. Tourism is the way. Let's move on to candidate number 16, Eri Rose Ong, representing Barangay San Roque. Hello, Eri. I will read the final question two times, and at your own time, you can give us your answer once you're ready. Eri, if you win Miss City of the Lisa 2022 and become an ambassador of tourism and goodwill, how or what can you do to contribute to the Action Agad administration of Mayor Samsam Gulias? One more time, if you win Miss City of the Lisa 2022 and become an ambassador of tourism and goodwill, how or what can you do to contribute to the Action Agad administration of Mayor Samsam Gulias? Mayong gabi sa tanan. If I win Miss City of the Lisa 2022, I think I can contribute to the administration of Mayor Samsam Goyas by being a voice for the voiceless, an ear for those who cannot hear, and an eyes for those who cannot see. And, is, and one more thing, Dakshon Agad has made an exemplary impact to the lives of every Talisainon. And I think that the values that we gathered from Akshon Agad's service has made true impact of a Talisainon. Thank you. Thank you very much. Daghang Salamat, candidate number 16, Eri Rose Ong. Our third finalist is candidate number 10, representing Barangay San Isidro. We have Shane Graysel Sansan. Hello, Shane. Congratulations. And good luck. This is the final question, which I will read twice. Shane, if you will win Miss City of Talisay 2022 and become an ambassador of tourism and goodwill, how or what can you do to contribute to the Action Agad program of Mayor Samsam Gulias? One more time, Shane. If you win Miss City of Talisay 2022, and become an ambassador of tourism and goodwill. How or what can you do to contribute to the Action Agad program or administration of Mayor Samsam Gulias? As I join this pageant, I have become a public image, and I will use that image to, to contribute the Action Agad by Mayor Samsam by using my voice and being a public figure to promote the advocacy of Samsam Gulias, and I will devote myself to Talisay City because this is my home and that's all. Thank you. Thank you very much, candidate number 10, Shane Graysel Sansan. We immediately move on to our fourth finalist. That's candidate number 21, representing Barangay Lagtang, Angela Christiana McKinney. Hello, Angela. Hello. Congratulations for making it this far. Thank you. Angela, this is the final question. I shall read it twice before you give us your answer. Okay. This is the question. If you will win Miss City of Talisay 2022 and become an ambassador of tourism and goodwill, how or what can you do to contribute to the Action Agad administration of Mayor Samsam Gulias? One more time. If you win Miss City of the Lisai 2022 and become an ambassador of tourism and goodwill, how or what can you do to contribute to the Action Agad administration of Mayor Samsam Gulias? Thank you for the question. I can promote the Lisai City as your future, Miss the Lisai 2022, with the crown I win tonight because the crown represents not only leadership but service to the people. And I can help anywhere I can, starting with tourism, helping to promote the culture, the food, the heritage, all that makes Talisay City beautiful because my heart belongs to Talisay City because we are always home 
in Telisai City. And to that I say, Abante Telisai! Thank you very much, candidate number 21, Angela Christiana McKinney. Finally, ladies and gentlemen, we have candidate number 20, Alexis May Wingfield. Alexis, Alexis, I know it's tough to be the last finalist, but you will breeze through this. So this is the final question, which I will read twice before you give us your answer. If you win Miss City of Talisai 2022 and become an ambassador of tourism and goodwill, how or what can you do to contribute to the Action Agad administration of Mayor Samsam Gulias? One more time. If you win Miss City of Talisai 2022 and become an ambassador of tourism and goodwill, how or what can you do to contribute to the Action Agad administration of Mayor Samsam Gulias? If I were to win Miss City of Talisai 2022, I would promote my advocacy of cleaning up our coastline. <laughs> because honestly, I believe that our coastline has so much potential for better tourism and better livelihoods, but we don't take care of it. Our beaches are filthy and full of garbage. And it's, it's honestly, it's sad. So, I don't think hope is lost, though. If we can work together as a community, I just a time limit, Di. Oh, <laughs> I, <laughs> I believe if we can work together as a community, we can do anything. And honestly, I think we can reverse the adverse effects we've been doing against our environment and make Talisai an example for the rest of the world to follow. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much, Alexis May Wingfield. So there you have them, ladies and gentlemen, the top five finalists of the search for the Miss City of Talisai 2022. A warm round of applause for them, please. Thank you very much, Vince Escario. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome one of the hottest leading men in the country, Marco Gumabo. What's up, Talisa Cebu? Sabay ni buwan ko manta. Namaste kita. Hindi mo alam. Pinapangarap ko ikaw ay aki. Masama yan. Mabukulang labi. At napanggan mong ngiti. Maabot hanggang sa langit Pwede mo mga body, no? Huwag ka lang titihin Sa akin na baka matunaw Ang puso kong sabihin Sa iyo hindi Ako'y nahuhumali At sa tuwing ikaw ay gagalaw Tu koi tu mi tigi para la sayo ang itang akong puso sana ibabansin mo rin ang lihim ko Nang hindi mo alam Huwag ka sanang madagali Kinamaan yata Talaga ang aking puso Nang datiyakan ako'y manihihin Hindi pa rin makalapin Nagkabasa aking titi Sabay, sabay! Sa iyong di Ako'y nahuhumali At sa tuwing ikaw ay lalapit Ang mundo ko'y tumitigil Ang pangalan mo Sinisik 
ikaw ng puso Sana'y matamahuli ang lihim ko Ako'y nahuhumaling Sa tuwing ikaw ay gagalaw Ang mundo ko'y tumitigil Parang sa'yo Ang awit ng aking puso Sana ay mapansin Muli Ang lihim kong pagtingin All right. What's up, Talisa Cebu? Ay ano to? May 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 nahulog yata ganis sa gawin nila. Hello, hello po sa yung lahat. Nako medyo maliwanag. Wala mo siya dumak kita. Hello, what's up? What's up? It's so nice to be here, and of course. To see all the beautiful candidates, how are you guys feeling? I'm sure na kinakabahan na kayo, kayo mga top five. But of course, may the best queen win! Sino ang mga boto niyo dito, guys? Ito, number... Sino yung mga number niyo? Number 20 ba? Number 21 ba? Number 10 ba? Number... Wala na, wala na yung dalawa. Hindi ko na nakita yung number nila. Thank you so much, girls. All right, so before I continue, meron ako sunulat para sa iyo actually. Ibibigay ko sa iyo. Thank you. Meron po sana akong gusto mga pasalamatan for making this night possible because without them, wala po tayo ngayon dito sa gabi nito. So, of course, sa ating mahal na mayor kay Mayor Sam Sam Gulas. Of course, si Mayor asan po si Mayor? Asan po ba ayon? Hello po, Mayor. Uh, magandang gabi po sa inyo. And of course, Congressman, or Congresswoman Rhea Gullias, Vice Mayor Choi Aznar, and of course, sa Talisay City Council. Of course, thank you. Huy! <laughs> Sama yan. Ito sa side na to, medyo ano, medyo may pagka X-rated SPG. The joke lang. Alright, so once again, thank you so much po sa lahat ng mga nandito. Okay, enjoy ba kayo? So do you want more? More, more practice? More, sige. Alright, sige. If you, if you guys know this song, sabayin niyo po ako. Sige po, play music. It took one look Then forever laid out in front of me One smile Then I died only to be revived by you And there I was Thought I had everything figured out It goes to show just how much I know About the way life plays out I take one step away Then I find myself coming back to you My one and only, one and only you Hola, Okif!
Alright, once again, thank you so much, Talisa City Cebu. It's so fun to be here, of course, to see each and every one of you. And of course, may the best queen win. Thank you so much. Good night. Have a good night. Thank you very much, Marco Gumabao. Ladies and gentlemen, it's time for the farewell walk of Miss City of Talisay 2019 and her court. Please welcome Miss City of Talisay 2019 runners up. Fourth runner up, DJ May Dente. Third runner-up, Nina Illustrissimo. Second runner-up, Jewel Alexei Mahi. Despite the hate that we always coming from you when your man is flipped over Sean Paul. Understand? Tell them they're ready for the level where they don't say they find. Turn up the bass and the cherry music and the weapon. Yellow wine up. First runner up. Lindsay Tesla. Let us welcome Miss City of the Lisa 2019 Angelica Pantaliano as she takes her farewell walk. Ladies and gentlemen, Angelica is representing Barangay Poblacion. Angelica also. Ladies and gentlemen, she will also represent the Philippines in the Miss Tourism International pageant this November in Malaysia. She's the pride of the Lisay, Angelica Pantaliano, Miss City of the Lisay 2019. Ladies and gentlemen, once again, Miss City of Talisay 2019, Angelica Pantaliano and her court, all wearing the creations of Roy Irwin Tazon. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome back Vince, Carla, and Chris. Finally, ladies and gentlemen, the moment we've all been waiting for. The judges have made up their minds, and our tabulators have tallied the scores of our five finalists. We are about to proclaim Miss City of Talisay 2022. This year, all of our top five will be wearing crowns especially designed and crafted by the Master Shandar. Talisay. The crown design are encrusted with 22 emerald green stones, which represent the 22 barangays of the city. The high pillars of the crown is a symbolism of the Talisay tree, which is abundant in our city. This represents resiliency and strength of its people, aiming high for a promising future ahead. The accent of seven pearls represent our seven coastal barangays, and the crown design in itself is a crown of stability, unity, and peace. 
Once again, designed by Mark Anthony Tinchavez of Shandar. You know, Aj, as you were saying designer a while ago, I would also like to take this opportunity to thank my designer for this evening. Daghang salama to Arno Pukamae for, of course, my beautiful, very princess-inspired gown this evening. You look like a Barbie doll. It's actually my debu. <laughs> and instead of 18 really? roses, it's 11 judges. Oh, wow. Yeah. What a special debu you just had. Right here in the city of Talisay. Huh? I know, it was a very special night. And you know, it's nice to see that as we said, after two years, we are back. There's now gonna be a new queen. Yes. A new ambassadress of goodwill for Talisay City. And I think it's time we get right down to it. Don't you think? Talisay, are you guys ready? But of course, before anything else, it has been a beautiful celebration, Vince and Carla. So ladies and gentlemen, let's give everyone a big, big round of applause. And we would like to now request attorney Rainier Mora of Mora Sanchez Vinoza and Associates Accounting Firm to hand in the results. Attorney Dagang Salamat. Here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, the results are in. To our top five, great job. Good luck to all of you. All right, Talisainons, here we go. Let us begin with the Miss City of Talisay charity. May we request Miss Fiona Ledeza, Mr. Archie Reyes Campo, and of course our fourth runner-up from Miss City of Talisay 2019, DJ Maydente, to please help us crown our fourth runner-up. Now our Miss City of the Lisai Charity 2022 will receive 14,000 pesos cash from the city government of the Lisai, a crown by Shandar, sash, bouquet of flowers by June Villanelle, products from Lure Loren International Corporation, 3,000 pesos worth gift certificate from Campotel Technologies, gift boxes from Staff Virtual and Charles Edward, gift certificates from Cebu Cha Cafe, Bella Glow Skin Set, and Celebrity Skin Gift Pack. And of course, to join in presenting the awards, Councillor Danny Caballero. And Miss City of Talisay Charity 2022 is candidate number... Candidate number 10, Shane Grazel Sansan from Barangay San Isidro. Congratulations, candidate number 10, Shane Grazel Sansan. Miss City of Talisay Charity 2022. Next, ladies and gentlemen, we have Miss City of Talisay Ecology 2022 to present the award. May we call on stage Miss Connie Codinera and Mr. Wendell Quisido. Miss City of Talisay Ecology 2022 awarding will also be joined by our third runner-up of Miss City of Talisay 2019, Nina Illustrissimo. She will receive 60,000 pesos cash tax-free from the city government of Talisay, crowned by Shandar, sash, a bouquet of flowers by June Villanelle, flowers and events, products for, from Floor or Lor Loran International Corporation, 5,000 worth of gift certificate from Camp Hotel Technologies Incorporated, gift boxes from staff, from staff virtual and Charles Edward, gift certificate from Cebu Cha Cafe, Bella Glow Skin Set, and Celebrity Skin Gift Pack. And to join our presenters, we have Honorable Rocky Bass. Miss City of Talisay Ecology 2022 is candidate number... <laughs> number...
number 20, Alexis May Wingfield from Barangay Tanque. Once again, congratulations, Miss City of Delisa Ecology, candidate number 20. And now the Miss City of Delisa Heritage 2022. May we request Councillor Manin Cabriana, Rafael Tan, Fuchsia Ann Ravenna, and Eva Patalinghug to present the award. Miss City of Delisa Heritage 2022 will receive 24,000 pesos cash tax-free from the city government of Talisay. Crowned by Shandar, Sash, Bouquet, courtesy of June Villanelle Flowers and Events. Products from Lor Laurent International Corporation. 7,000 worth of gift certificates from Camp Hotel Technologies Incorporated. Gift boxes from Staff Virtual and Charles Edward. Gift certificates from Cebu Chat Cafe, Bella Glow Skin Set, and Celebrity Skin Gift Pack. And Miss City of Talisa Heritage 2022 is candidate number. <laughs> candidate number 17, Gliza Bulgado from Barangay Maghawai. Congratulations, Gliza Bulgado. Candidate number 17, Miss City of the Lisai Heritage. Congratulations. Now we move on with the Miss City of Talisa Tourism 2022. To present the award, we have Councillor Lester Don, Michael Burr Anton Kamali, and Chris Tiffany Hansen. Miss City of Talisa Tourism 2022 will receive 30, 32,000 pesos cash tax free from the city government of Talisa, a crown by Shandar, a sash. Bouquet of flowers by Jun Villanelle Flowers and Events. Products from Lour Laurent. Lour Laurent International Corporation. 10,000 pesos worth of gift certificate from Camp Hotel Technologies Incorporated. Gift boxes from Staff Virtual and Charles Edwards. Gift certificate from Cebu Cha Cafe. Bella Glow Skin Set and Celebrity Skin Gift Pack. Miss City of the Lisa 2022 grand winner will be awarded by Congresswoman Rhea Gulias and Mayor Sam Sam Gulias together with the Honorable Councillor Donaldo Hontiveros and Carrie Santiago. Miss City of the Lisa 2022 will receive 40,000 pesos tax free cash from the city government of the Lisa, crowned by Shandar, Shash, bouquet of flowers by June Villanelle. 30,000 worth of products from Lor Laurent International Corporation. 15,000 worth of gift certificates from Camp Hotel Technologies Incorporated. Gift boxes from Staff Virtual and Charles Edward. Franchise for Pastel Fruit Halo Halo by Cebu Cha worth 199,000 pesos. Gift certificate from Cebu Cha Cafe. 
10,000 pesos worth of gift certificates from Skin 911, Bella Goes or Bella Glow Skin Set, 5,000 Pepsi products, and 10,000 cash voucher and gift back from Celebrity Skin International. Ladies and gentlemen, we have two ladies left, and one of them will be your Miss City of Talisai 2022. City of Talisai, who's your bet? Now, Cynthia of Talisai, we will be announcing first our first runner-up or our Miss City of Talisai Tourism 2022. And first, I would like to take this opportunity to thank Manuel Hartumake for my barong this evening. And special thanks to Maquillage Artist Par Excellence, Roni Matudan. All right. And thank you also to Keith Bacayo for my hair. All right, perfect. Here we go. Vince, Carla, are you ready? Yes, we are. Let's go. I am ready. Or ugmat na lang tamo announce char. Cindy of the least, I undoubt na babo. Tara na. Here we go. Talisay dons. Miss City of Talisay Tourism 2022 is candidate number <laughs> candidate number 16 so miss city of the lisa 2022 is candidate number 21 congratulations of the Lisi Tourism 2022 is candidate number 16, Ari Rose Ong from Barangay San Roque. And Miss City of Talisai 2022 is Angela Christiana McKinney. Once again, ladies and gentlemen, the new Miss City of Talisai is Angela Christiana McKinney from Barangay, Lantan. And crowning Miss City of the Lisa 2022, please welcome Mayor Sam Sam Gulias and Congresswoman Rhea May Gulias together with Miss City of the Lisa City 2019, Angelica Pantaliano, along with the Honorable Congressman of Cebu City, Don Don Hontiveros, and Pride of the Lisa, internationally renowned couturier, Kerry Santiago. City of Talisa, make some noise for your Miss City of Talisa 2022, candidate number 21. Congratulations, Angela Christiana McKinney. Once again, congratulations to our city officials headed by Honorable Mayor Samsam Gulias, Vice Mayor Choi Azar, the entire city council, and our beloved and very supportive Congresswoman Rhea May Gullias. Congratulations for a job well done. Our heartfelt thanks to Talisai City Budget Officer and overall chair of Miss City of Talisai 2019, Mr. Edgar Mabunai, and City of Talisai Tourism Officer Nikki Aznar and her staff, and the rest of the City of Talisai Performing Arts for your wholehearted support. Let's all give the loudest applause at the Nam Talisai Nun. Mabuhi ang talisaynon ug sukbuanon. Tomorrow, ladies and gentlemen, October 14, 2022, we invite you to witness Talisay's Pride Halad Inesal Festival. Daghang salamat. Good evening. Viva, Viva Santa, Santa Teresa, Teresa de, de Avila. Abante, city of Talisay. Oh,
Bye. 